Hi, I'm Brandi Skidmore with Usborne Books and More, and today I want to show you a few of our history reference books. Um, the first one is The Story of Inventions. It has all kinds of inventions in here, from the woman who invented the dishwasher to microwaves, glasses, Here's x-rays, just things we take for granted. One thing about all of our nonfiction books is they all have a colored background on the pages because studies are showing that it's easier for younger students and students with learning disabilities to see the page if the background is colored. So that's the story of inventions. The Geography Encyclopedia and World Atlas also has the colored backgrounds, tons of pictures and illustration, full page on, full color on every single page, excuse me, and um, with this book there are larger and smaller fonts, and the larger the font, the more concrete the information, so the younger the student will be when they can understand it, and this has a full world atlas in the back as well. Um, this is a Lift the Flat book. It's newer. It's Sea Inside Exploration and Discovery. So if you're teaching history and you're learning about Columbus, for example, so there's a whole Lift the Flap on Columbus. And um, Lift the Flap books are great because kids love interacting with these. And this is the Lift the Flap Picture Atlas, which is very similar, but it's an atlas. So you can see this is Europe, so it has several flaps to lift with more information underneath. Uh, this book is the book of famous paintings, and this is a very cool book because it has full color, again, the colored background, but it also has little things that make it a little more approachable for children, little illustrations, and I was an art history major in college for a while, and I will say that the information in here is very detailed. Um, and then this book, Time Traveler, is really, really cool. Um, it's set up so you're this character and he's got his time traveling goggles on. It explains where you're going, the people you're meeting, and then it has all kinds of information. This is the Time, like medieval ages with castles. It has what the inside of the castle was like, what the people did. This is um, how people in this time dressed. Here's um, a tournament, a knight's tournament. And then um, it goes through the medieval times, the Vikings, the Romans, and um, the pyramids. So there's tons of great information in here and it's kind of fun because you could make some great um, unit studies with this where you know you're incorporating your storytelling and your history work all together. All right well those are the books I wanted to show you today. I hope you have a great day.